everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, I wanted to tell you about my experience at the Girls Who Code Summer Immersion Program. Before we get started, make sure that you like and subscribe so that you don't miss any of my other videos. So I started my journey with Girls Who Code back in the sixth grade when I still live in DC. I did a club at my local library for two years. It was really, really fun. I even got this cool Girls Who Code book at my graduation. Made a lot of social impact projects, talked about the environment, and I just had a really, really good time meeting other girls who love to code like me. Girls Who Code is not just a class, it is a community and a lifestyle. They even have a book series that I really love and I reviewed it a while back on my channel, so make sure that you check those out. Those will be linked in the description. Now, when I was in sixth grade, something that I was really excited to do was join the summer immersion program, but it's only for high schoolers. So when I finished the ninth grade, I applied, I got in, and I started the summer immersion program virtually. The first week, we learned HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, and the second week, we made websites about causes that we cared about. Mine was early detection and a cure for prostate cancer. My group sponsor was Bank of America. It was really fun to work with them because they brought a white hat hacker. A white hat hacker is someone who works with a business to hack into their website to test their security. So they talked about how they hack into Bank of America's website to help with their security and even showed us how to hack into a website. Not that I'd ever do that in real life, but you know, it's good to know. Another cool thing that they did is that they helped us with professional development. They talked to us about how to do our resumes, how to send professional emails, and how to get internships in college. They also gave us a really cool parting gift to help us with back to school. They gave us this really cool backpack that is filled with goodies. I was really excited to get this because I love all things back to school and you know I love free stuff, so. <laughs> they didn't tell us exactly that they were gonna give us this, but they were kind of hinting at it because they were like, hey guys, why don't can you just like tell us your t-shirt sizes? It's, it's like no big deal, we just like kind of want to know. The first thing in here is Poppy Handcrafted Popcorn Made with Love from North Carolina. Pure simple popcorn happiness. It's a salted caramel popcorn. This is really good. They also gave us a t-shirt that says Girls Code the Future, which is really cool. I'm so excited to wear this. You know, I love to rep my nerdiness, so I'm really excited to wear this to school and just represent being a girl who codes. They also have some hand sanitizer, which is very useful and convenient because going back to school in a pandemic, you're definitely gonna need to have hand sanitizer on hand. They also gave us this medal. This is Bank of America on one side and Girls Who Code on the other side. This is it, it's nice, it's really heavy. I love it. Oh, they gave us some stickers. I love stickers, especially for back to school because my laptop is covered in stickers. They also have one, oh my gosh, I love leather notebooks. This is a leather notebook, oh my gosh. And it has re nice recycled paper on the inside. This is really nice. They also have, I'm not sure what's in here. There's like a, canvas pouch on the inside is purchase with a purpose fashion and compassion Ooh, oh my gosh it's a bracelet so this is like a nice sustainable bracelet i love how it feels it feels very organic it's a little bit stretchy and it has the little and charm on it the last thing in here is a brownie by magic morsels it says bite-sized fairy tale brownies that is everything in our congratulations package. I absolutely loved doing the Girls Who Code Summer Immersion Program. The teachers were great. It was really nice to see some other black girls who code that are already in college or past college and are working. My teacher was even working at IBM, which is really, really cool. If you wanna learn more about Girls Who Code, then you can check out the link in the description to their website where you can find a club near you or even start one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure that you like and subscribe. Bye!